I got my nails. So, these things I hate. Because I can't bloody well open them. This week is going to be an interesting week, inshallah, because uh, there's a conference tomorrow, the Dijima conference where I'm invited, and um, then I have a lecture at LUMS on uh, the 26th. Today is the 20, was 23rd of November, Monday. And uh, tomorrow, the conference on 24th and the 26th is uh, the lecture at LUMS. It's 7 p.m. I think it's only uh, for the students at LUMS. So if you are not a student, you probably can't attend that. But um, I'm excited because I'm really, you know, warming up to this whole idea of uh, teaching. And uh, because I do that online, and uh, now I'm not thinking of taking that offline as well. And uh, so that's an interesting experiment to begin with, and uh, I'm, I'm excited to to take this take this message of the pro hobbyist and you know living a life of adventure and all that to to a premium institution here in Lahore. Right now, what I want to do is I want to work on um, getting a few websites uh, upgraded, my client websites, and um, yeah, and um, you know get a few things in order so the remaining week should go smoothly. A few moments later. The thing is, I'm trying to inculcate this habit of. Uh, what is that? I'm trying to inculcate this habit of um, doing small things but over a long period of time rather than doing a lot of things over a short period of time and then doing nothing for a long period of time. Um, this is. Let me, let me explain this to you. Oh, by the way, this. Um, this is how I mitigate my work. I'm not working and I'm illustrating. I started with this. I posted a picture of this on my Instagram that you should follow. But uh, this red is too red, I think. Right, let, me, let me show you what I mean when I say about the kind of work that I'm trying to do. Let me go all Casey Neistat on you. Okay, so... So over time, you are putting in your effort. I was introduced to this term, chaotic and intense. So yeah, this actually doesn't make sense. Let's try again. Imagine this is the total amount of work that you want to do. And now there are two ways of doing this work over time. Now this can be our time. Now there are two ways of doing the same kind of work. Let's see the method that is most common for creative fields, most common at least for people who are starting out, people who are amateurs, people who don't know what the hell they're doing, people like me, they have this kind of work. They do a large amount of work here in like the beginning part of whatever they're trying to do. Then they don't do anything, they dabble, they go all over the place and they sometimes like leave the frame and then they come back and they're all over the place and then they realize the deadline is there blah 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 and in comes the other part and they're done. Now there are other more intelligent ways of doing the same kind of work and that is that you divide this into manageable chunks. So this and these two are the same amount of work but they have a very different way of doing them. And I am right now confused as to what type of work goes where because both are very very legitimate ways of doing work. Right? It's like uh, um, Apollo Coelho does this kind of work. They do intense writing in one period and then they don't do anything and then they do intense writing at the end, for example. And then uh, there are other people who do very, very regular work. 
and my phone is not focusing. But they do very regular work over time. They, for example, write 1,000 words every day or 2,000, 3,000 words every day. And over time, they build their body of work. And that is, this is what it is about, building your body of work, which I can't focus on. Anyway, the elaborate point that I'm trying to make here is that thinking about work and doing work are two different things. I have spent this whole day thinking about work rather than doing the work. For example, tomorrow I know exactly what I need to do. I have it planned out. And planning days are important. Doing days are also important. And it's not easy to think. You need to decide which day should be planning day and which should be working day. Both are important. I think I have a plan. I'm working on that. So, subscribe to this channel. You know, like if you're watching this on Facebook. Subscribe if you're watching this on YouTube. You know, sign up at the blog, justadventure.com. And join me in my journey. And together, perhaps, we can uh, produce the kind of work that we are proud of. And have a really good time doing it. So, um, I'll see you and I'll see you. Take care. God bless and just adventure.